clerk will take the call. Baltimore County Delegate Jay Gillissi, a no-show for Tuesday's session of the Maryland General Assembly. An investigation by the Joint Committee on Legislative Ethics is recommending a public reprimand of the delegate. The accusations? An ongoing pattern of bullying and abusive workplace behavior. Undeniable that there's an expectation for all of us to treat everyone around here with respect and civility. A record of complaints against Delegate Gillissi dates back to 2015. These accusations include Gillissi called a staffer stupid and incompetent, made the staffer stand in the delegate's office and repeat, I am incompetent, I am incompetent. Gillissi forced his staff to work overtime but would not sign off on their time cards. A staff person described the work environment as toxic, saying Gillissi had no patience and no self-control. Delegate Gillissi called the allegations a political hit job, writing in a statement, Sadly, over the past few months, I've been the target of a nasty smear campaign and sham investigation by a powerful lobby in Annapolis. Delegate Gillissi reportedly had numerous chances to change his behavior. The speaker requested he complete an anger management and workplace civility program. Gillissi did not. As a result, the General Assembly will not pay his staff until he completes the program. If he doesn't participate in anger management by the next session, the speaker will strip him from all committees. Back in 2015, a Baltimore County judge issued a protective order against Jalissi. His college-aged daughter alleged he slapped her and verbally harassed her. The report speaks for itself, but uh, every member will be held accountable for their actions, especially in how they treat people that work here. A reprimand is expected on the House floor on Wednesday. This will be the second time delegates have disciplined one of their own this session. Reporting live from Annapolis, David Collins, WBAL-TV 11 News.